Hi guys, it's me, Melissa. Today I am gonna do a walkthrough of the Halloween Tarot. Here's the box. You guys have probably seen this. Um, it was out, it's been out. It's a uh, 78 card deck, features many spooky characters in the my minor arcana suits, are pumpkins, bats, ghosts, and imps. I don't think it says anything. Oh, the festive old time Halloween world of Kipling West conjures up all that's fun about Halloween. Let the black cats guide you on a trick or treat mission to find out what is lurking around the next corner in your world. I could not get this deck um, last year. I looked all over the place for it and I could not find it. Um, so I finally found it. Um, I found it on Amazon. And I says, well, I'm ordering it because I really wanted this deck. So it comes with a little white book. All right. And this is by Karen Lee. And the art is by Kipling West. It is a U.S. Games games deck um i believe this was published in 2012 uh, yes copyright um 1996 and 2012 by us games so the little white book has a welcome to halloween the halloween tarot reading the cards and then it goes into the major arcana the minor arcana the suits are pumpkins, ghosts, bats, and imps. And then it has um, about the artists. So, and it is a 35 page book, a little white book. I'm gonna take a drink. Here's my cat cup. Love my little cat cup. Okay, so. Here are the backs of the cards. They are reversible. I love these. And here, uh, it comes with two extra cards. Let me take those out. The first one is just a regular little card that has the Halloween tarot on there and it's by the artwork is by Kipling West and then it has whoops I'm throwing it around here then it has another little card with some info on it let me see what it says here whoa tiny print here all right bear with me sometimes our lives seem shadowy and it is hard to tell what's around the next corner much like Halloween night, when what is imagined is probably much scarier than what is really going on. Whatever the season, jump into the fest festive. It's slightly freakish. Old time Halloween world of Kipling West and let the tarot cards speak, help you speak. Take a closer look at what may be lurking in the shadows of your life. The Halloween Tarot deck is divided into 22 cards of the Major Arcana and 56 cards of the Minor Arcana in the suits of pumpkins, which are pentacles, and earth, bats, which are swords and air, ghosts, which are cu cups and water, and imps, which are wands and fire. And that's about all that says there. So those are two cards. And I think that's the same. Yep, it's the same. The back, backs are the same. So let's get into these. My favorite, ho favorite holiday is Halloween. I love, love, love Halloween. Everything about it. Um, I don't, I've always loved Halloween ever since I was younger. And the older I get, the more... I love Halloween. 
<laughs> it's kind of weird, but I don't know. I love seeing the kids dressed up. I love the spookiness of Halloween. Um, even in my witchy room, if that's what you want to call it, I have my spooky things up because I just adore them and I love them. So anyways, so the first one is the fool card. It's a little gesture and he's got black cats on one side and pumpkins on the other. And there's a black cat and he is holding, it looks like maybe uh, he is juggling and the moon is up there and the stars. So there is our fool. I love this card. Little green moon and the stars and just adorable. So there's the fool and it does have um, the numbers on here. So uh, the magician, we have the black cat. We have um, kind of reminds me of Gomez or a magician. Um, of course, it's a magician. He's pulling a ha uh, cat out of the hat. There's a ghost there and a bat, and we have a skull with the pumpkin and the little devil in the corner. So there is the magician. Very, very Halloween-ish. She looks like Gomez to me. The High Priestess. Now, she reminds me of Morticia. We have the, she's standing on the moon with a black cat. She has the book in her hand. She's talking to her, um, looks like she's looking at her plants growing. And she has a bat hanging. The Empress. The Empress has the black cat. She has her cauldron sitting there. She's sitting on a purple like settee. There is a um, monster hand coming out from underneath with the stars and very, very pretty. The Emperor is Frankenstein. We have the black cat. We have him in a chair um, holding a, looks like a something in one hand, a ball maybe, or, and some kind of a cross in the other. There's a candle you can see out the window. Um, there's a flower. It looks like there's a brain on the inside. Next is the Hierophant. We have a mummy. We have the two um, cats on the one side. We have the black cat, of course. Um, there is a staff with a pumpkin on it. We have two green cats down at the bottom. These are more of the um, pyramid type cats. We have the lover's card. We have Count Dracula. Um, we have the black cat. There's a girl in bed. She has some love letters. Um, there's also a dog in this picture with a necklace on the side and a candle. And he is coming in probably to give her a bite on the neck. <sighs> The next one is the chariot. 
we have the stars you can see in the sky. We have the big, uh, oh, curse. We have a pumpkin driving, the cat's in the front seat. We have the Egyptian cat on the side. The purple car. The next one is strength. Looks like we have a, uh, we have the lion. And it looks like she is looking at him. Um, maybe trying to help him out. Maybe as a sore tooth or something. The black cat is in here. She looks like she is, um, oh, what do they call them? The headmaster of like the circus. We have infinity symbols on the curtains. The hermit. We have the hermit. Um, he is doing some kind of a science experiment, it looks like. Um, we have a frog in this picture. We have the black cat and a mouse. We have the skull. We have a hand um, out of the, um, the hermit's pocket. And we have some pictures on the, the wall. I love the colors of these cards, guys. Of course, my favorite colors are black and orange, so. But they're so bright, brightly colored, especially look at this Wheel of Fortune. We have the Wheel of Fortune. He's on a circle. It looks like they're throwing knives. He's out. He's got his hands, hands wrapped. His feet are wrapped. Um, and it looks like it's a throwing spinny where they're throwing knives at him. Look at the colors. The colors are so Halloween-ish colors. The purples and the reds and the blues and the, the greens and the yellows and the blacks, oranges. We have justice. We have the pumpkin head. We have the raven. We have a uh, voodoo doll. Down by his feet, we have the black cat. We have a mouse on the, uh, the weight. What do they call the, the weight? We have the owl, bats. The Hanged Man, we have the Scarecrow. The Black Cat is there. We have the Two Ravens. We have the Fall Leaves. Um, it looks like there's fire in the background and I'm not sure what these two little people are down here on the bottom, these two little figures. There is the Hanged Man. Next, we have death. We have flowers with faces on them. We have the um, vulture. We have a little um, muskrat, it looks like, butterflies. The black cat, the pumpkins. Um, the skeleton is watering the pumpkins. In the background, we have the, uh, the castle. Next, we have a little witch. 
Um, we have the black cat. We have an owl. We have tomb dust. It looks like she's mixing something up in her cauldron. Um, we have the finest bat wool. Um, we have a little, like maybe a little dog here. The devil, we have the she-devil. Um, she has her fork, her pitchfork. There's three little, I don't know what you call those little gnomes, imps maybe, um, with their chained up. She's take, looks like they're going for a walk, kind of. We have the rat, um, a spider. We have an eyeball. We have the black cat. We have an imp in a jar. Next, we have the tower. We have the haunted house. We have a pumpkin. We have a... Gargoyle. Um, looks like there's a lizard. We have the ghosts in the windows. The ghosts flying out of the windows. We have the crown falling off the top of the house. And of course, the black cat. Great tower card. The star card, we have a gargoyle. We have a clock tower. We have a cat. We have the um, beautiful star. Kind of looking down over the village. These cards are just stunning for Halloween. I really resonate a lot with these. Um, the moon card, we have a, um, I think they're called bull terriers. We have the wolf um, howling at the moon, looks like. Uh, we have a lobster or a crayfish. We have a black cat. And it looks like he, I'm not sure. Looks like he's howling at the moon. Next, we have the sun card. We have the beautiful sun in the background. With the sunflowers, we have the two-headed monster. We have skulls. Um, the one is sucking on a bone. Um, looks like maybe a deer in the background. Potatoes hanging, maybe, um, in the black cap. Judgment. We have um, the three mummies in the coffin. We have awakened sleeper, rise, and then another there with um, a skull on there. It looks like Count Dracula with the moon shining down. Great depiction of the world card. We have the lizard. Uh, we have the bat. We have the um, eel. And we have the crab. And the black cat is in the center. With the bones are making the circle.
So now we're on to the pumpkins, which are the pentacles or queens, which is the earth sign. Um, the ace of pumpkins. We have a candy treat that she looks like she's handing them out <clears throat> um, in her, would be her right hand for giving. Um, we have the flowers. We have the um, candy. We have the puff of smoke, like the rider weight. Two of pumpkins. We have the black cat. We have a jester. We have the infinity symbol. We have the moon and the stars. He's on his tiptoes. Three of pumpkins. We have the um, craftsman. He is arranging his pentacles just so. And the black cat is watching. So there's the three of pence, three of pumpkins, which would be pentacles. We have a little bean dude. Uh, I don't know what else to call him. Um, he's got, it looks like a turn up for a head maybe, or the root of the head. He has, uh, beans for his legs and his arms. It looks like a cucumber body. Um, we have the black cat. That's really cute. And the four of pumpkins. You guys see him. He is cute. We have the five of pumpkins. We have um, the devil, uh, a boy dressed up as the devil or the mother dressed up as the devil. We have the black cat. We have a little boy that looks like he's dressed up as a clown with a bat on the front of him. It looks like his candy has dropped on the ground. Um, he looks upset. They look like they're um, out in the cold. The six of pumpkins, we have a, um, a child dressed up as a ghost, one dressed up as a black cat. We have the witch handing out candy. The black cat is in the window watching and we have the seven of pumpkins. We have the scarecrow. Um, he is gazing at the pumpkin patch, admiring his hard work. Um, we have the black cat. Eight of pumpkins. We have... <sighs> I don't know if this is an onion, a turnip, a white vegetable head um, man with the black cat sitting behind him and he is carving the pumpkins with such delicacy, making sure everything is correct and perfect. Nine of pumpkins. We have this beautiful lady um, dressed up. She has a hat, a feather in her hat. She has an owl on her, her hand. She is admiring the pumpkins. She is dressed beautifully. Um, and the black cat is down by her feet. Ten of pumpkins. We have a little boy, and he is gonna hit the the um what is it? 
the candy um, with his, looks like a wand there. We have another little um, creature that's holding on to the pumpkin, pulling it up and down. We have the black cat. We have a, uh, a tree with things to climb up and pumpkins all in the tree. The page of pumpkins. We have a ghost flying around. We have a girl that looks like Wednesday from the Adams family. Um, there's books wrapped up. The uh, moon is out. The stars are out. We have the black cat and she is staring into this pumpkin. We have the Knight of Pumpkins. We have this knight um, riding on this horse. There's pumpkins all over this horse. The black cat is also riding on the back of the horse. The stars are out and he is holding a pumpkin. Looks like he's gonna maybe give it to somebody. The Queen of Pumpkins. She's sitting in her her throne. She has a pumpkin on her lap. Pumpkins on her her dress. She has her crown on. Beautiful moon. Um, the stars. We have a plant. Um, several plants. We have a rabbit. Her blue in her Blue and the purple and green. King of Pumpkins, we have a throne with two skulls on the sides. We have him with a pumpkin on his robe also and a bat collar. We have gargoyle at his foot and the black cat. Okay, so now on to the Ace of Ghosts. So ghosts would be your cups. So we have the Ace of Ghosts. We have the black cat, a hand, the left hand holding a chalice with the water sipping out of the chalice. We have the two of ghosts. We have two little ghosts. <clears throat> Looks like they're dancing. We have the black cat with wings on it above their head. And we have the two-headed snake. Here we have the three of ghosts. We have the three ghosts in a circle. Their robes are entwined. We have the three, we have the three cups they're holding up in the air with the black hat. Four of ghosts. We have the four little ghosts. We have a boy sitting under a tree, kind of just sitting there like, oh, um, in the black cat and the one looks like he's offering him something warm to drink. The five of ghosts. We have a pumpkin head. We have the five ghosts. Um, and the black cat. And it looks like he's chained maybe. I'm not sure. Six of ghosts. 
<clears throat> we have the six of ghosts. It looks like they're in front of maybe a church. Um, two of them are holding a, or one is giving the other one a flower. And the black cat is walking on the wall. The seven of ghosts. We have um, seven little ghosts. Each of their shirts is has a different symbol on it. One is a diamond. The other is a snake. So the one on the knight on the bottom has the cat on his shoulder and he has to choose. He has a choice to make. The eight of ghosts. We have eight little ghosts. We have a gentleman walking up a steep hill. Um, everybody is like, oh no, oh no. And the black cat is just watching. Oh my God. Nine of ghosts. We have the ghosts or a... Uh, Skeleton man um, sitting on a bench. The ghosts are behind him. We have the moon and the black cat. We have bats on his bottom of his robe. Ten of ghosts. We have a skeleton. We have a... Looks like a, she's dressed as a devil. We have a cat, a child dressed as a cat. Another is a clown. Um, the ghosts are in the air. They're, it looks like a happy little family on Halloween nights. We have the page of ghosts. We have a boy. Looks like he was dressed up as a ghost. We have a ghost on the back. We have him holding a cup with a fish in it, a letters on the ground, and the black cat. We have the knight of ghosts, we have the black cat, we have the, um, the knight holding a scroll <clears throat> on the horse. Queen of Ghosts, um, she is part mermaid. Um, we have a little ghost underneath her. Um, well, we have three little ghosts on her throne. She's holding a pumpkin and there's a ghost flying in the air. King of Ghosts, we have a ghost. We have the um, king sitting in a chair, we have Bones on his robe. We have a fish necklace. We have a fish on the fish skull on the ground. He is holding his chalice in the middle of the water. Next, we're on to the bats. The bats would be your swords. So we have the bat hanging upside down on the finger. The two of bats, we have two bats flying in the air. The girl is tied up. Blindfolded. We have the three of bats for the swords going through the heart. The four of bats, we have the bats um, one is sleeping, the pumpkin head is sleeping in bed, and we have the bats, like they're going to go right through. Mm. Got to remember the bats are swords. We have a gentleman holding treat, ba treat, um, candy treat bags, um, Five of bats, we have a clown, we have the bats in the air. Looks like somebody's dressed up as a cat there. 
So these are very um, Rider waite ish in their imagery. You can see a lot of the similarities of Rider waite Six of Bats. We have the boat. We have the pumpkin head is the one steering the boat. We have the rippled side on the one, the clearer side on the other. We have the black cat and we have the two people in. Looks like they want to get away, start something new. They're leaving something. We have the seven of bats. We have a whole bunch of bats in a basket like Santa Claus with a onion head, turnip head figure. We have a lady, eight of bats, um, all with mummies. Looks like they're wrapping her up as a mummy. Nine of bats. She is sad. She's in bed. She can't go to sleep. She's thinking. There's so many things going on. Ten of bats. It looks like she's drowned or about to drown. We have the page of bats. We have him walking um, along. The bats are standing on, or up on the side. He has his bag. He's ready to go. We have the knight of bats. We have the knight. He's carrying a bat flag. He is ready to charge. We have the queen of bats. She's in her throne with the bats. All around, there's a butterfly and the black cat. <clears throat> we have the king of bats. He has bats on his beautiful purple robe, a butterfly or a moth. We have the black cat. The stars are in the background. Next, we have the Ace of Imps, and the Imps would be wands. So we have the little devil on the Imp. The Ace of Imps. I love this one. The Two of Imps. He's got the, I don't know what it is, a pumpkin man maybe. He's got a hold of the two Imps by the back of their they're next. <laughs> we have three imps. Um, the three of imps. We have one holding a tree, two holding fire. The black cat. Here's the four of imps. Five of imps. Looks like they're fighting with their ones. Six of imps. They're riding on a horse. I love how the black cat's in all of these. Seven of the imps. It looks like they're going on a tour, maybe. The one imp is in the front showing them the haunted house. The eight of imps all have their, their swords. The nine of imps. The Ten of Imps looks like the Hunchback of Notre Dame. 
He has all his little imps in his hand and one has fallen out. That looks like he's stealing them. The page of imps. Looks like little lizards or something on his outfit. The knight of imps. Yeah, it looks like a lizard on his shirt. We have the queen of imps with her beautiful robe. We have an imp giving her a sunflower. And the last one, guys, is the king of imps. We have the imp in the background. We have the cat gonna catch a lizard and we have a sunflowered um, lion on his throne. So guys, I hope you like this. Um, this deck is one that I've really wanted for a while. Um, so I'm really glad and excited that I've gotten it finally. Um, again, this is by Karen Lee and the artwork is Kipling West, and this is the Halloween Tarot. Um, I got this on Amazon, and it wasn't very expensive at all. Um, I think it was right around $12 or something like that. So I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Um, keep on watching my videos and hit the bell um, so that you can be notified every time I upload a video. Uh, I have Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays, I post uh, the tarot study. Tuesdays, Tuesdays, um, Thursdays, sometimes Saturdays, and Sundays, I post other videos like this kind of stuff. Um, so keep your eye out. I also have um, the crystals that I did. And I'm going to do some how-to videos here. So I hope you guys like this. Please subscribe to my channel. I love you guys. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Bye, guys. Love you.